Let's factor the equation 2x squared plus 8x plus 6 equals 0. And probably the first thing we should do is, since we have even numbers, 2, 8, and 6, let's just divide each of these by 2, and that'll give us... So you can see I've taken the 2 out here and just simplified this down to x squared plus 4x plus 3, and now we can factor this. If we look at the signs here, we have a positive and a positive. That means that we're going to have a positive and a positive here in our skeleton equation. And now we're just finding the factors for that last term and they should equal the middle term, add up to the middle term. So for three, it's just one and three. Those are the factors. And you can see one plus three gives us four. So we have factored this equation here. And we do need to remember to bring our two down here. So now if you check this with the FOIL method here, you'd have first, outside, inside, and then last, you'd end up with we can combine these to 4x. We have x squared plus 4x plus 3. That's what we had right here. So we've correctly factored x squared plus 4x plus 3, or you could even consider we factored the whole 2x squared plus 8x plus 6. Let's quickly find the values for x here that'll make this 0, this side of the equation 0. So we have 0 equals 0. So we could say x plus 1 equals 0 and then x would equal a negative 1 over here, x plus 3 equals 0, so x equals negative 3. If you put negative 1 here in this equation for x, negative 1, negative 1, or up here, you'll find that all of this or all of this would equal 0. Likewise, if you put negative 3 in for x here and here or here and here, it would all equal 0 as well. So these are the correct roots. If you use the quadratic equation, you can get this same answer right here. This is Dr. B factoring the equation 2x squared plus 8x plus 6 equals 0. Thanks for watching.